Ready, set, go. go. My name is Hunt. What can be better in elk or land? So Hunt has mitochondrial disease, which is an energy disorder. For some kids, it affects their heart. For some kids, it affects their brain and they have seizures. For Hunt, it affects his GI system. Now, doctors said he would never walk, and now, you know, he had braces on his legs and a walker, and now he's hiking, running, walking, jumping, dancing. Mike and Hunt Hollis. Hunt is seven. He's he'll be eight in about 15 days. Yeah. Um, but developmentally, he's probably about five. So Hunt has mitochondrial disease, which is an energy disorder. And for some kids, it affects their heart. For some kids, it affects their brain, and they have seizures. For Hunt, it affects his GI system. So from birth, he threw up large amounts, um, very often, and. Um, there are times that his, he, his GI system works fine, and there are times that it just completely shuts down. And so because of that, um, he's small for his age, he has low muscle tone, mm. um, and he's been in feeding therapy, physical therapy, occupational therapy, and speech therapy his whole life. Now, doctors said he would never walk, and now, you know, he had braces on his legs and a walker, and now he's hiking, running, walking, jumping, dancing, and we've definitely defied the odds, so... You know, yeah. we say not a statistic that he is, you know, going to do things that we never thought he would. And so earlier this year, Hunt really got into watching overlanding videos. And he discovered this whole new world of jeeps and rock crawling. And we decided that adventure was for us. And so we took a big trip this summer and we went from Yosemite to Mount Hood and we did a lot of it off road. And, um, even did some stuff along the coast. And it was the best thing our family's ever done, to get totally disconnected, away from work, away from technology, and just be together. And Hunt really thrived in those three weeks, having quality time with our family, and just completely being present. And that's something that it's really taught us, is to go out to the woods and turn off your cell phone. I mean, you don't have any access. Roaming was not an option this summer. And so it's really helped us to just completely be present. Um, and for him personally, you know, he's been in feeding therapy his whole life. He ate more in three weeks than he's ever eaten. Um, just because we, it, it was what it was. You know, we have what we have when we camp. Um, his vocabulary increased. His social skills, you know, you're in a campsite, you meet new friends and meet new kids. And he loves that social aspect of it. And so it's really brought him out of his shell. So Hunt's uh, condition means he has... Um, has temperature sensitivities. So hello. highs and lows. So we and hello. that's right, buddy. And, he, and he's got a real sensitive diet. He's got a real sensitive tummy. Tummy? Yeah, that's right. I do have a tummy, Daddy. When he's hot, his body doesn't sweat. And when he's cold, it doesn't warm itself up. So when we're outside, we have to be careful with uh, making sure that we have cooling elements like you know ice and things like that. We also make sure, you know, if it's cold outside that we have um, hats and jackets and blankets. So Mike got a refrigerator that we have in the back that has a refrigerator and a freezer, which really helps to be able to have, you know, cold milk and water and ice and um, not knowing, you know, how many days you're going to be away from a store. But overall, um, he's doing really well on the spectrum of mitochondrial disease. The purpose of Team Hunt Overland Adventure is to um, show that everybody regardless of disability or age or status or um, anything can, can go adventure and that outdoors is great for everyone. Did as much as we could to the Jeep in uh, about a month's time. We have a lot of Blue Ridge gear. We've got to keep things organized. Um, we are very organized in the Jeep. I think we've used just about every inch of space in that thing. Um, and all Front Runner and all the other vendors that have been a um, a big part of the journey have been awesome, so they allowed us to have fun. In our trip, we had to figure out how do we use every possible ounce of space. 
and the Fleurge bags are awesome um, because of the they fit perfectly in the footprint of the pillar here. And so I've got Velcro on inside it and I can quickly kind of get in and out, you know, from tablecloths to batteries to um, a lot of the drone equipment, stuff like that. It's safe and it doesn't move around, it's quiet, which is awesome. And I get to use space that I wouldn't otherwise. Is Blue Ridge Toolkit, Blue Ridge um, Recovery Kit, Blue Ridge Headrest with uh, patches and storage. And that's the end. <laughs> that's it, that's it. Hey guys, I'm Matt from Blue Ridge Overland here, and we are here at Overland Exposition East. Our favorite part is meeting new people and hearing their stories. We hope you enjoyed it too. Shop all our gear at BlueRidgeOverlandGear.com where everything is made in America and handcrafted for adventure.